Hi everybody, this is Michael from the FTT team. This is a short tutorial on how to use the FTT HTML template. Um, a lot of people are asking because this feature is not yet built into FTT. So I decided to create a short um, tutorial and the script to also make it happen in FTT. So I have this um, basic project here, Flex project in FTT um, with just one class and let's go ahead and run it. By default it uses this external Swift viewer here and this is my application. But now I want to make use of um, the FTT HTML template um, to create these um, wrapper files um, for my Swift. So I just go over and copy the FTT HTML template folder into my project and these are the files provided by the Flex4 SDK. Um, but I created this template build XML and this properties file here. And the first thing you have to do is just edit this property file. And the main title of the HTML file is treehouse. And my main Swift name, it's the name of um, the Swift without the Swift extension is um, just treehouse. And you also have to set the output folder, so in my case it's the bin folder. And um, the required flash player is OK, background color and width and height are also OK. So cool, I'm done with the properties. And the last thing I have to do is just um, right click my build file and go to run as ant build or you can also drag it into this ant view here and hit the run button. Uh, now the script um, adds the template files and the wrapper files into your binary folder and you see you have the treehouse HTML created here and the last thing I'd like to do now is I want to um, use the browser as a viewer and it will also change Swift to HTML to test um, not the Swift but my generated HTML. So by hitting debug it will again um, compile my application and if it's done it will um, show the browser and the HTML file. So here's my browser and here's my HTML file. Cool. Every time you make changes to your template HTML, so this file here, you can make changes to this, you have to run the, the build script again and it will regenerate all the files for you.